In this video, we'll take a look at Millennium SV Update 1, a Windows 11 transformation mod that brings the look and feel of Windows Me to Windows 11, with some additional improvements to enhance the accuracy of the OS. For starters, this mod is now available in two versions. One uses a traditional look and installer which highly resembles older versions and the one that was featured in the initial release. Then, there's another version which uses the default Windows 11 print solution environment, which can be useful in case you experience issues with the other interface. In case you're using a laptop, you'll find a battery meter icon on the system tray, and there's also a safely remove hardware icon as well. This opens a dialog displaying hardware devices you can select and remove. Contents menus have also been modified for improved accuracy. The desktop menu now displays an active desktop item. Keep in mind that this is just decorational as none of the options do anything. There's also the explore and search items as well, and they do work. Now opening file explorer, there's been some minor tweaks, such as the computer object on the status bar being renamed to my computer. Then the windows folder now displays its name in all capitals, just like the real OS. Also the properties dialog will now show a version tab which displays the item values on a text box. The classic control panel has also received some changes. The add or remove programs applet now displays both 64 and 32-bit applications. The system properties applet now displays the build number that would appear on Windows Me. There's also the addition of a device manager tab, which is not functional, but still a neat touch. As for the modern control panel, the personalization applet no longer fails to load under classic theme. The same thing goes for ease of add to center, storage spaces, and work folders. Finally, as for the shutdown dialog, you can now log off, shut down, or restart directly from here without having to do it manually. And with that said, hope you liked this video, if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.